Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. In this video, let's continue our adventure in the series of our quest, the Dirge, the Dirge of uh, Bilk. This time we have to do Dune and Tom the uh, Fecundity, part 1. So just click on Navigate it and follow the mission. Why part 1? Because this world quest is really really long and each part will be, yeah, will take you maybe from half hour to one hour. If you read this story. So, let's go to the mummy. Okay, we have to go into this place. So this time uh, we, uh, we we have to walk there. So, so yeah, just to use this teleport waypoint and uh, walk uh, to that point. Pretty simple. I advise you to go directly to this one and then this one, so you will be able to unlock both teleport waypoints. Okay, here we go. The TP point is downside there. Just take it down. And activate it. Also, you don't know how to reach the new boss. The new boss is here, but underground. So, just to jump down into this hole. You will meet it eventually. Our next teleport waypoint is on that mountain, so let's go. Here we go. Now, just to drop down. Downside here, you will trigger the next part of the world quest. Yeah, now you will hear something is coming. Just to defeat the enemies. Alright, now let's just keep follow the road. Going down toward the canyon. Okay. Look for objective in this area. I have to go toward that machine. And investigate. Just activate it. This door will open. How to reach the door? TP and walk. So here you will find another device. Activate it. So this thing will uh, just uh, start to put a uh, sense. And now we need to reactivate this one. How to do that? So first of all, let's kill the enemies here. Okay. Uh, just activate this one. We will connect the tunnels. Going inside, activating this one. Okay. Now let's go inside the wall. I mean this room. Once you're inside the room, you have to go here and rotate this one. Once you rotate, the outside one will be available and a chest will also spawn. Let's don't care about the chest. Let's start this one. We will connect the next tube. Okay. The sand can flow. Yeah, you see? This is one of the rooms which will require this type of clearance. If you guys don't have the clearance, this one, I made a guide about it, how to get it, the last one. Because from the first part of the desert, we can get the other six, while well, this one is only from the new desert area. Just to check that guide if you don't have it. But anyways, for now we don't need to get inside this room, this is for the future situations. It's just to show you. Now, keep activated this one, and go up. Here, the door will open, so just wait a bit. Okay, look objective in this area. The path ahead, ahead there lies within the sand. Another puzzle to do, guys, so follow my steps carefully. 
Once you sell the room, TP to the last point. Here. Then trigger this pillar. It will change the flow direction into that one, and that the stone will be available to be activated. Just open it and get inside. Once you're inside, let's kill these two enemies because they are annoying. Okay. I was saying, once you're outside, I mean, once you're inside, you can open um, this gate. So you will be able to reach that point faster using this one. You should already have all the other four clearance. If you completed, as I told you, at the first episode of this series, which is uh, completed the golden slumber and the dual evidence to get all the other six clearance, you can open this door. Anyways, now you have to activate this one again to change the flow on right side this time. Okay. So by doing this, you can use this device. So activate it. The wall here will disappear. I mean, become invisible, not to disappear, because you can. St yeah, there is still wall. Rotate this cell. It will open the barrier. Get inside the barrier. Activate this one. The elevator will bring you to downside. Once you're bottom side, let's kill enemies first. Okay, after killed, so let's simulate that we're coming from there again, from the elevator. Alright, once you're inside, you have to trigger one by one these puzzles. How to do this? First of all, rotate this cell. For that one. Then, come here. And rotate this one. Volva. So it will trigger this wall. Making this wall invisible. Rotate this one. And this door will open. Okay. Once you did this, rotate back this one. To make this wall invisible, so it can unlock the device. No worry about the door, because once you open it, the door will remain open forever. Get inside and open this one. The sand here will disappear also. Now we can just get out from here. And there is a chest. Here we go. Now let's just uh, go downside. Hmm. Let's follow everything and you will unlock a hidden teleport waypoint again. This one underground. Good thing they added this one located in non-outdoor area. Now, if you go bottom side, you will see another another room which will requires you the new uh, clearance to open to enter. We don't need that one. Just uh, go on the left side. We need to go inside this big room. Once you kill them, you can use this device and proceed proceed deeper. Well, go here first because you need to, yeah, the loopers fragment. It will just basically power up your gadget. Increasing her function in the desert. Yeah, you see? Basically this. Anyways, now look up. And keep progress with the room. So keep navigate with the reward rest. Downside. And turn on your right side. Okay, here we go in this room. Another puzzle to do. First of all, defeat this enemy. Once you defeat, activate. It will open a chest, I mean trigger a chest, and also open the door. Let's don't open this chest yet. We don't need. Just go downside. Keep going. 
And finally, we reached our final position. Activate this device first. Small cutscene. And go downside. Now I activated the big mechanism. Dominance will spawn. Just to kill them all. Nice. Go to this big room, you will see a really really big sandstorm because we are getting close to the center. Okay, another small dialogue. That's not enough because we still have two parts to unlock. Anyways, the bottle will tell you. We return to the surface. Azarik is here. Hmm, this is pretty sus. Why is Zarek so sus? Here we go. Part 1 done, guys. Now is the next one. Dune and Tom the Fecundity Part 2. So we finished the first part, guys. The video yeah, is pretty long, so let's finish it here. And we continue with the next video. The Part 2. So I hope this video helped you guys to... So I hope this video helped you guys to finish the Part 1. Thanks for watching. And see you in the next part. Bye!